Oh shit guys, shit's going down. Um, Hanoverian forces have just sent Merkel, August Merkel, oh my god. It's like Angela Merkel, the Prime Minister of Germany. I don't know if anybody's like noticed that. I just noticed that, but Jakob Schmatz is fighting August Merkel. Uh, and we won, thank god. This will make everything easier. Um, so the Hanoverians are trying to crawl back to the Dutch. They wouldn't be trying to fight the Dutch. They're allies, right? They're against the Swedes. That's right. The king died. Shit. I got Sophia the first. She has a harsh reputation. But whatever. Um, Lithuania is a little upset right now. Probably because they're like second capital of this great realm. Egypt go without taxes. Could really use it if you would, could take a little more taxes. There we go. That's all well and dandy. I got a great cabinet and a great queen right now. But Russia might declare war on me for succession. Oh my god! Sweden took Archangelisk. This could be good, this could be bad. If Sweden turns out to be more powerful than Russia, and they declare war on me, it'll make my job harder. But at the same time, Sweden is not my ally since 1700. Has not been my ally since 1700. So it's not that bad if I preemptive strike them. So that looks good. Everything's in my favor right now. Shit's not happening. Winning battles, taking Cologne. The Rhineland gehört zu mir. Or mir, I don't know. Fuck it. Rebuild that shit. Exempt them from those taxes. Destroy that classical university. Rebuild that classical garden. And we will hold off. Just because Clavis farmland is so close to where I was, I'll upgrade it to a palatial estate. Palatial, I don't know, fuck it. Wait, what the fuck happened? Oh, here they all are. I thought I lost fucking four ministers. Uh, they, the like building just burnt down or something. I would be pissed, to say the least. So we're totally converting at the speed of light. 1.6% a turn. No biggie. Also, here we go with states. Great estate. 
states. Here, I'll probably forget Corland, and they've been good, and it's cheaper to build there anyways, so whatever. All this can So I'm pretty much upgrading really fast right now. Super agriculturalizing, I don't know what the term would be. Or expediting the amount of farming, I don't know. Croatia gets a farm. I feel like Russia, uh, whoa. You know I'm tired when I say Russia instead of Oprah. I feel like Oprah giving out farms, farm upgrades. Okay, so that's all I'll be able to do this turn. Until next time, folks. Save. And literally. stacked force right there. Together, we will fight the Dutch Devil. <laughs> the Dutch Devil. I'm glad I made that. Time to save, a time to end turn. Till more farms need to be built next time. And roads in Wurttemberg and Rhineland, I believe they don't have metal roads yet. But so, the Balkans really, the Bosnia and Greece don't. And nowhere in the Middle East does, but they're stinky and they're angry Muslims that just are like, and don't build here. I don't know. I don't know how to please these people anymore. Just guys, while this is going on, keep a eye keep an eye on the map. See what happens between Russia and Sweden because shit just went down, man. Seriously. Then again, if you look at Arkhangelsk, I mean, its capital city is like right on the water, and Russia leaves it undefended a lot. And if you look at Sweden, I mean, it's not a far journey. So if they want land, it's not a not a bad target. It'd be pretty easy. Russia might be pissed. Our relationship is probably love hate right now too, because you know. I'm trading with Sweden. I just fought their ally. Declared war on their ally. That's different. Um, they took.
took land I wanted, I took land they wanted, Georgia, right? They probably would have wanted Mesopotamia, too. I eliminated the threat that is the Turks. They were fighting them worse than I had fought them in the past. And now they're fighting the Swedes. They just took Karelia back. Look at that. That's why you always gotta have a defense when you're fighting your neighbor and you have a lot of land that's not, that's exposed to a lot of different regions. get metal groves. You get metal groves. There's five farms I can upgrade with the money I have. Let's do Transylvania. Castlevania. No. Just kidding. Moldova. Doesn't have metal growths. Because they're poor as shit. We'll let them starve. I don't care. You're up first, huh? You're up first. You are up first. Land in Croatia needs a building. Croatia is 100% Catholic. Fairly content. And could use... That's what I'm going to build. I'm talking all calm because it's late at night. But my sister isn't home, so who cares? Talk loud. Um, seriously, though, this could be a pretty big burden on my hard drive. Just went through it, cleaned it out, made way for Team Fortress 2. Um is taking quite a long time to download, if I may add. But I hope it doesn't fill up. I'm making these videos pretty long for the diehard fans only. Star Fox Assault will be something new. If you're one of the people who subscribed to me for Total War, there will be other games like this in the future. I'm thinking about doing Victoria 1 in the distant future, maybe like fall of 2012 or something. Damn, I'm thinking ahead. But for now, 
I'm going to return to Nintendo, and I'll probably be cranking them out pretty fast. So, I'll just start a new video here, because it went on quite a bit. See you later, guys. Pella 4.